Who are the Moors? The Moors were black North Africans who conquered Spain and Portugal, parts of Italy and other parts of Europe throughout the Dark Ages. From 711 to 1492, black men ruled different parts of Europe. See, check it out. This is the history they try to hide from us in school. These are different paintings from different European museums. These different black men and women have brought Europe out of the Dark Ages. We taught Europeans about everything. We taught them how to bathe, how to cook, brought clothing, all kinds of stuff. This is the history they don't teach in school. These are the North African Moors from 711 to 1492. These black people ruled different parts of Europe. By the time the Moors got into Europe, the illiteracy rate was very high because there was no practical reason for people to read at the time because people were really trying to survive. So the only people who could read at the time were monks or religious figures. So the Moors went into to Europe and they started to establish universities. The first university created in Europe, the University of Salamanca, uh, they created the education system that Europe adopted. They brought in what became classical music. Um, they're the ones who uh, brought architecture and fineries. In fact, it, it was so advanced that the teachers in the Moorish uh, paradigm during their, in the Iberian Peninsula, the teachers under the Moors got the equivalent of $40,000 a year back then. That's how advanced they were. In fact, yeah. The town's striking coat of arms depicts the so-called Moor of Coburg. The emblem is now at the center of a heated controversy. Opponents call it a symbol of racism, but many residents are mystified. Is there really nothing else to worry about? We've got bigger problems than the Coburg Moor. He's the patron saint of Coburg and I find this whole discussion out of order. He's never upset anyone. It can stay as it is. The crest dates back to the Middle Ages, when black people were often described as Moors. 